Hey, what's going on pros? This is Diggy Man from the Venture Pros and I'm here to show you how to install this new mod. It's been around for a while now. It's not new, but it, oh, it's so great that it freaking keeps on updating. It's the auto switch mod. It is fantastic. I'm going to use it in every build I play from now on and uh it just as long as you have it in your hot bar, it just if you need it it will automatically switch to it. It is great. Spikey is going to do a mod spotlight right after this, so he can show you exactly what it does. But I'm going to—I'm here to show you how to install it. First thing you're going to need to do is install both of these mods right here: the Minecraft Forge two two point no, two four one Forge and the Auto Switch mod. Okay, and put them on your desktop. Make it easier for you. If you put them right on your desktop so you could use them. Okay, this is how you're going to do it. You're going to come to your start button. You're going to put percentage, app, data, percentage. And you're going to come up to your roaming here. And you are find this file that's called .minecraft. You're going to open it up. And next thing you're going to do is find this bin file here. Left click it twice and then you're gonna find this minecraft jar file it should say jar file right about here and minecraft right here you're gonna right click it and open with winrar or 7-zip like what I just did and next thing you're gonna do is grab this meta inf here find this meta inf in your jar and right click it and come down to delete file are you sure you want to delete file? yes that's done. Okay, next thing you're going to do is open up your Minecraft Forge with WinRAR or 7-Zip. And you're going to left click it, select all files, left click it again, this time hold it down the left clicker and drag it right over into this empty space over here and let go and press OK. And close all these windows out and start up your Minecraft. You have to do this so Forge makes his own files and it gets installed inside before you put your mod in. Now Forge is in, it says there's two mods loaded. You open it and you see Forge Mod Loader and Minecraft Forge in there. And that's all you need to see. Now go into your start button in your search bar, go to percentage app data and you will find this dot minecraft open that up and now you can see that forge has built a couple of new files and the most important one you need right now is this mods file open that up by left clicking it and you're going to see you have no mods in here now you have this auto switch mod and grab it put it over here drag it right in there and that's pretty much it you close it out start up your minecraft it should work out perfectly forge is a great program and there you go guys um, you see auto switch mod in there now and now if you push this option button here and come down to Bozine's options there and auto switch options there you go. Now this little window opens up before you start the game and you could enable like enable auto switch. You could make all kinds of adjustments. You just have to read them up and put keys. You could, you know, all kinds of good stuff. You could go through that on your own time. Let's start this up and make sure this world does work pretty good. there you go and we're in looks great to me guys thanks for watching my install I am Diggy Man I'm out just stay tuned for Spikey's uh, spotlight thanks for watching guys don't forget to leave us a like favor the video if you really like it and thanks for watching pro I'm out what's going on pros here with the auto switch mod spotlight of death <gasps> and look at my rainbow that I built it's gonna be so amazing so basically what the auto switch does is 
when you're mining, right? See, look at you see right there. When you're like using a certain thing, like see this dirt, it switches to my shovel. But while I'm doing this, I'll be doing in slow motion the first couple blocks that I hit, so you'll see it very clearly. But it switches to the item that's best for your for what you're trying to do. So let's get started right away. It's gonna be so hot. This mod, you should get it. Oh, dude, I already seen it. It's the best. Okay, let's do this. She looked at that. Even I'll switch to my apple. It switches right back to my apple once I'm done. And it even works on ores. Okay, now I'm gonna go super fast to the school. Okay, so now we're at the wood, the wooden planks. I should really, should, I should have really had, maybe, uh, there we go, brightness. Sorry, guys. So, so basically, it's going to switch to my axe when I... Go, so I'm going to have a pickaxe in my hand, and you're going to see. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You guys are probably asking, why... I'm using iron tools is because I wanted to show you really slowly so that you could have seen it how it switches even though logs get getting wood super slow motion style I heard the spy chickens around here too, guys. Hey, look at dirt. Shovel comes out, dig it all out. Cheers. Cut student. What the? Spy chickens! Perfect time to see what the sword does. Switches right away. Oh my god, alright pros, that's the the auto switch mod. I hope you liked it. I hope you enjoyed and stuff. I'm Spikey2000 with the auto switch mod. Out! Oh, stupid spy chickens. Woo! Yeah!